Good morning, my K2A students. So welcome to our K2A math that we're going to learn about superlative. Okay, on page 25. But uh, before going to learn about superlative, I want to review about uh, what you have learned in the previous videos. So, uh, what you have learned uh, from last week, you learned about uh, comparison, that you learned about uh, the word tall and short, uh, you learned about the word big and small, you learned about fat and thin, and you also learned about old and young. And comparison here uh, refers to when you want to compare things or people between two things or two people and uh, we talk, uh, we review about tall and short when you want to compare uh, two things about the height the height of two things or two people and uh, uh, when we uh, use the word big and small when we want to compare the side of two things and when we want to uh, use the word the word fat and thin when we want to compare about uh, the side to the side of two people or two things and last one is uh, when you want to use the word old and young when we want to compare about the age the age of uh, two things especially the age of people two people so that's it of uh, comparison and uh, today we will come to you uh, the lesson that relate to uh, comparison uh, we are going to learn about superlative okay so superlative it uh, refer to the comparison to but uh, it compare more than two things it means uh, we uh, use this form uh, to compare three things, three people, or more than three, to find that which one is uh, the highest point and which one is the, the lowest point. Okay, now uh, to make it clearer, let's see the example. Okay, so here is a superlative that we're going to learn about the word tallest and short tail okay when you know uh, the word tall you also know the word tallest okay so tall and refer to uh, the one who is the highest the highest when you compare three people and uh, short tail short tail when you want to compare the height of the one that is uh, the short tail one okay so look at this uh, example you see we have three people not two anymore that this is your papa this is your mama and this is a doctor the doctor of parents the doctor of papa and mama and then uh, these three people they standing uh, nearby each other close to each other and uh, the question is who is the tallest who is the tallest and who is the short taste so when you look at the picture you really can answer this so we go to uh, daddy or the papa we know that the height is one two three so papa is three what about mama one two one two in two what's about doctor zero one one so when you look at the number right here you really can answer the question so the question who is the tallest who is the tallest is it the daughter Doctor only one. About mommy is the tallest one? No, the mommy is only two. But who is the tallest? 
3, you 3 is a top one, right? So 3, who is the tallest? Your papa? The answer is yes, the papa is the tallest. So right here, you, you can complete right here. Who is the tallest? So the answer is papa. So you write here. Papa is the tallest. Papa is the tallest person. Okay, so read this question. Who is the tallest? Papa is the tallest. Mm -hmm. And second question is, who is the shortest? Look, who is the shortest? Who is the, in the rate of number one? Papa is number one? No. Mama is number one? No. Doctor is number one here. The shortest one and no more. Right? So doctor is the shortest person. So the answer here, complete the word. Doctor. Alright. So read this question. Who is the shortest? Doctor is the short test. Okay? So this is how between tall legs and short test. Okay, now here is uh, uh, some examples or exercise for you that, that can test how much you understand. So here is answer these questions. So we have uh, two questions here that you need to complete by looking at the pictures. The like question number one is which tree is the tallest? Is the tallest here? Is it tree A, tree B, or tree C? This is what you have to complete. Question number two is which tree is the short taste? Is the short taste? So which tree? 3A is the short test, 3B is the short test, or the 3C is the short test. So you look at the picture right here, the picture given right here. 3A, number 2, 3B, number 4, and 3C is number 3. So when you look at and understand the pictures, you really can answer these questions. So that's it for uh, Tall test and short test, and we will learn more in the second video. Bye. Hi there. So, uh, welcome to our K to A match, and uh, we have a quick review first before we continue our lesson. So, uh, what we have learned so far, we learn about tall test and short test. So, when do you tall test and short test? When we want to compare about uh, things, like more than three things, or more than uh, three people, or can be three people or three things, or more than this. And uh, we compare this, uh, we want to find out which one is the tallest one and which one is the shortest one. So this form we call superlative, okay? Superlative. Alright, and now we're going to uh, learn one more form of superlative that we learn about the word biggest and the word smallest. Okay, right here is called uh, biggest and right here we call smallest. Okay, so let's read it. Biggest, biggest, smallest, smallest. And well, we can hear uh, we use the word uh, biggest and smallest when we want to talk about the size, the size of uh, three things or more than three things uh, to find out which one is the biggest one and which one is the smallest one. And right here it is uh, the example. So look at the fruits. Okay, fruits. Here we call fruits. Okay, right here we call fruits. And there are many different types of fruits, but I recently 
three types of fruits for you that you can learn you walk at and also you can learn uh, about the superlative form so the first one is apple apple right the second one is strawberry 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 and this one is cherry 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 right here there are three three types of fruits like apple strawberry and cherry and uh, now we will uh, find out among the three types of fruits that which one is the biggest fruit and which one is the smallest fruit so let's find out right here there are two questions the first one is which fruit is the biggest you also uh, please note and uh, try to read this and speak it at home too you will not only answer the questions but practice your speaking as well which fruit is the, which fruit is the biggest the answer is is the biggest fruit so which one is the biggest fruit so look right here right here and right here so which one is the biggest one may you answer me please all right the answer is apple apple is the biggest why when you look here only here only here but each one here so apple is the big the biggest so complete here apple all right so apple is the biggest fruit apple is the biggest fruit all right and we go to the second question is which fruit is the smallest again which fruit is the smallest so the answer is is the smallest fruit so which fruit look apple is the biggest one and now we compare about this again strawberry and cherry look which one is smallest smallest one like too small a tiny is cherry right the answer is cherry is the small blade so complete here is cherry is the smallest fruit okay so that's it for the answer so right here is about big A and small A that we learned about the size and here is your uh, one more exercise that uh, to reflect from your lesson is about answer the questions and right here we will learn a new vocab vocabulary that we learn about transportation yeah about uh, 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 some transportations that we want to compare to find out which one is the big day one and which one is the smallest one so the first one is bus 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 b-u-s right bus the second one is bike 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 and the third one is car 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 bus bike car so here i want you to take a look for a few seconds and decide and and, and find which one is the biggest transportation and which one is the smaller transportation and here is the question which is the big a so which one is the big a right here is the big a so you need to complete here if you see the bus the biggest bike is the biggest or car is the biggest transportation and here the second uh, question is which is the small like the tiny one so you decide bike bus or car is the smallest one just write the words right here and submit me into your online group so that's it for big guys and small A, and see you in the last video clip. Bye! Hello everyone, so welcome to our last video clip of K to 8 months that we learned about superlative. Okay, 
and I want to summarize what you have learned in the previous two videos that we learned about uh, the com uh, like the superlation, the superlative about uh, the word big gain and small gain. Then we learned about psi when we want to compare three things or more than three things to find out which one is the biggest one and which one is the smallest one so you use biggest and smallest like apple, strawberry and cherry so which one is the biggest when you look at the side of the apple is the biggest one because if the bigger than all this one so we can say that this apple is the biggest and which one is the small end? When we compare the size of the cherry to apple to strawberry, only cherry is the smallest one. And another part you also learned about the word tallest and short tail that we learned about, and we want to compare about the height of three things or more than three things. Like look at the pictures right here. There are three, three trees, but you can find out which one is the tallest one. Which one is number four? Go. The three A right here. The three A right here is the tallest one because when we compare about this one, the A to B, A is taller, and compare A to C, C uh, like A is still taller. So the last one we can say that 3A is the tallest tree, okay? And what about C, which one is the shortest tree is 3C, why? When we compare 3C to B, C is still a shorter one. And when we compare about C to A, C is shorter than A. So in the applicant, uh, I assume that you can say that 3C is the shortest 3. Okay, so that's it for the big A, small A, taller, uh, tallest, and shortest. Now we're going to do your homework in your uh, textbook. So, homework is in your textbook, your K to A textbook on page 25. Okay, now we go and I will explain you how to do your homework. So, your homework right here is on page 25 that we learn about uh, the word tallest and shortest so over here you can see your the family you can see uh, your daddy you can see uh, the son or say brother you can see your mommy or your young mommy and you can see uh, the daughter like also the sister or the brother so here they are uh, four people in the family and they have the different height so over here uh, they give uh, the word tallest and short and give many different lines so what you have to do is you have to match uh, or draw or trace the line from the word tallest to the tallest person and you go to the word short text and, and trace the word, the line right here from the word short text to find to match the short text one right here. Okay, so this is what you have to do is tracing from the word tallest and short text to each uh, people that, that the tallest one and the short text one. So that's it for your uh, homework, and uh, uh, that's all for the lesson for K3 Max. So uh, hopefully, you can catch up the lesson pretty well. But if you have any doubts or any questions, you can ask in our group. I will be there to have an answer and correct for you. So that's it for uh, K2A Max. So see you in the next lesson. Bye.